to another episode of Sea Time TV. We're here with the Jupiter Marine Unit and we're going to be talking a little bit about what is required for a vessel check. Basically, what are you looking for during a vessel check? Safety is first and foremost, so we're looking for life jackets, vessel registration on board, fire extinguisher, mm -hmm. flares. You want to have a first aid kit. The Coast Guard puts out an excellent publication of all the things that are required. Well, what we're going to do from here, we're going to talk about actually trying to cross the Jupiter Inlet, and you guys can give us some tips on safety. Mark, you, you've gone up and down this inlet for many years. Can you talk a little bit about the Jupiter Inlet and, Absolutely. and your experience with it? The tides are ever changing, the winds are ever shifting, and this can be a very dangerous uh, inlet if you don't have any local knowledge. What kind of things do you need to tell your passenger before you're going to go through an inlet or pass a boat or, you know, just any type of unusual things that you need to be aware of? Well, that's a good question. It's the captain's responsibility to warn your passengers to hold on, be back towards the back end of the vessel with something secure to hold on to. And don't forget, have a plan B. That's all for today's episode. If you've missed any part of the segment, just go to SeatimeTV.com and we'll be seeing you on the water.